Right, let's move on to 1.2. 1.2 says, one of the many investment options in South Africa is a stockpile option. Okay, Table 2 below shows two stockpile plans, Plan A and Plan B, over a 24-month period. Okay, So here's two stockpiles. There's Plan A, there's Plan B. They're both 24 months. Um, over here, it says that um, the you here you have monthly contributions of that amount. Here you have a once-off. Right, so you just pay 60,000 months off and there's no recurring, right? Then over here it says the total amount at the end of the 24 months, total amount at the end of the 24 months. So you're comparing these two, right? It's going to ask us various questions. So it says here, use table two above to answer the questions that follow. Define investment in the given context, right? So the given context is a stock file. So it is, make sure that you're writing this correctly, 1.2.1, right? It is a form of saving, Form of saving, right, placed uh, in a financial scheme, because that's what a, a stock file is, right? It's a pool of funds that everyone puts their money into. It's invested, and then you get to take um, your amount that you invested back out, and you get interest, okay? Interest, remember, is a reward for having given someone your money to use, right? So it's a form of saving placed in a financial scheme, right? Right? That will result in interest. So it's result in interest or give interest, etc. Okay, so there's the saving and there's the interest. Those are your two marks. Let's go on to the next question. Calculate the total contributions for plan A over the 24 months. Now for plan B, the total contributions is just 60,000, but it's upfront, right? It's not over every month, it's literally 60,000 upfront. Here you have two and a half thousand for 24 months. So you have to say this there times by 24. Put that into your calculator, right? 2500 zero, zero, times 24. And that's going to be 60,000 Rand. So the total contributions for both of them are the same. But this one you pay 60,000 all at once, which is quite difficult to just fork out 60,000. Here you pay two and a half every month for 24 months. Because here you don't have to pay this massive upfront, right? You actually are going to get less interest at the end. Whereas if you're able to pay this uh, 60000 upfront, you get more interest, okay? And that's just sort of the mechanisms they're trying to show you. Obviously, different people have different affordability. So it would be different choices for different people um, given their needs. Calculate the interest earned if a person invests in plan B over the 24 months. Okay, so there's plan B. The interest they earn is going to be this amount here, the total that they get out, minus what they put in, right? That's what interest is. So we're going to say 1.2.3. We're going to say 92065.71 minus 60,000, right? I'm going to put that in. 92065.71. Be careful that you're typing it in correctly. Minus 60,000. And your answer there is 32,000. Uh, and 65 rand and 71 cents. And please remember your rand value. Okay, that's your answer there. Let's go to our last question for this little sub question. It says, determine how much more interest a person will earn investigating in plan B, investing, sorry, not investigating, investing in plan B compared to investing in plan A over the 24 months. So basically saying, compare this to this. How much more interest are you getting in plan B compared to plan A? So not a difficult thing. You're just going to say, Make sure that you can see. Um, 92065.71, because that's what you get from plan B, right? Minus what you get for plan A, which is this amount here. Because the difference between those two amounts, right, is going to be the amount of extra interest that you're earning from plan B, right? Because you gave that big upfront payment. 92065.71 minus 74286.84, Okay. And you put that in, make sure that you're putting in your RAND value, right? Make sure you've input everything correctly, 778.87, right? There's your answer there. And we are done with this question. Let's move on to the next question.